హలో ఫ్రెండ్స్ ఈ వీడియోలో మనం రంగారెడ్డి డిస్ట్రిక్ట్స్ మ్యాథమెటిక్స్ ప్రాక్టీస్ పేపర్ వన్ గురించి డిస్కస్ చేద్దాం మనకి మ్యాథ్స్లో త్రీ సెక్షన్స్ ఉంటాయి పార్ట్ ఏలో ఫస్ట్ సెక్షన్లో సిక్స్ క్వశ్చన్స్ ఉంటాయి టూ మార్క్స్ ఈచ్ ట్వెల్వ్ మార్క్స్ వెయిటేజ్ సో ఫస్ట్ సెక్షన్లో ఫస్ట్ క్వశ్చన్ సమ్ ఆఫ్ ఎ నంబర్ అండ్ ఇట్స్ రెసిప్రోకల్ ఇస్ టెన్ బై త్రీ దెన్ రైట్ ద క్వాడిటిక్ ఈక్వేషన్ టు ఫైండ్ ద నంబర్ సో సమ్ ఆఫ్ ఎ నంబర్ వీ డోంట్ నో ద నంబర్ లెట్ వీ టేక్ ద నంబర్ యాజ్ ఎక్స్ అండ్ ఇట్స్ రెసిప్రోకల్ రెసిప్రోకల్ ఆఫ్ ఎక్స్ ఈజ్ వన్ బై ఎక్స్ Why I am writing plus here is simple students because they have given sum of number and reciprocal and the product is or the result is 10 by 3. So we have to express this one in terms of quadratic equation. So x into x is x square plus 1 whole by x is equal to 10 by 3. When two fractions are equated we have to do cross multiplication. So 3 should be multiplied with x square plus 1 and 10 should be multiplied with x. 3 into x square is 3x square, 3 ones are 3 which is 10x. So this is the quadratic equation. Draw the Venn diagram of the sets A union B and A intersection B. The only the intersection part, for example, if we take this blue color dotted lines, this part is called A intersection B. It's a common area for both A set and B set. So we have we have to represent with A intersection B. So the common elements which is orange color is nothing but A union B. If the radius of a hemisphere is 21 centimeters, then find the volume. Given radius of hemisphere is given as 21 centimeters and volume of hemisphere is given by the formula 2 by 3 pi r cube. So pi value is 22 by 7, radius is 21 centimeters. So we have to write 3 times because r cube. 7 ones are 7 threes are 21 3 3 get cancelled the value of 2 into 22 into 21 into 21 is fourth question krishna says the probability of event is 13 by 7 do you agree with him give reasons no i will not agree with krishna because 13 by 7 value is greater than 1 probability will always lies between 0 to 1 including 0 and 1 so probability of event can be 0 which is impossible event it can also be 1 definite event or certain event and it also can lies between 0 and 1 but definitely not greater than 1 so 13 by 7 is obviously greater than 1 and it is not a pro probability of an event fifth question find the 13th term from the end of ap 83 80 77 74 so on to 11 We have to arrange these numbers in a reverse way. So 11, 14, 74, 77, 80, so on till 83. So after arranging the numbers arithmetic progression in a reverse manner because they are asked to find from end. So we have to use the nth term formula which is a plus n minus 1 into d. 13th term is given by the formula a plus 12. A here is 11, d here is clearly 3. So 11 plus 12, 3 is 36, 36 plus 11 is 47. So 13th term of this arithmetic progression from reverse or end is 47. Next question, find the polynomial whose zeros are log 16 base 2 and log 27 base 3. So to find the quadratic polynomial, we have to use the formula x square minus sum of zeros into x plus product of zeros. We don't know the two zeros, we have to find based on the given condition. So the two conditions are based on the two conditions we will find two zeros so first condition is log 16 base 12 and second condition is log 27 base 3 so log 16 can be expressed as 2 power of 4 2 power of 4 value is nothing but 16 so i'm writing 16 as 2 power of 4 and log 27 can be expressed as 3 cube base 3 so we know the formula of log a power of m m log a so this will become 4 log 2 base 2 and it will also become 3 log 3 base 3. So 4 times 1 is 4 because log a base a logarithm function and base functions are same the value will become 1 4 ones are 4. And here also log function and base function log 3 base 3 is 1 so 3 times 1 is 3. We have to apply to these two zeros in the given quadratic formula. The quadratic formula is x square minus sum of zeros so two sums are 1 is 4, another is 3, product, product of 2 zeros, 1 0 is 3, another 0 is 4. 4 plus 3 is 7, 7 times x is 7x, 4 3 is 12. So x square minus 7x plus 12 is nothing but the quadratic polynomial for 2 zeros. 
Moving on to section 2. In section 2, we have 6 questions. Each question carries 4 marks. Total weightage 24. In this section, we have all the options under students. We have to attempt all the questions. Find the two numbers whose ratio is 2 is to 3 and product is 2 16. Don't know the two numbers. Let the two numbers be 2x and another number is 3x. So why I am taking 2x and 3x because ratio is given as 2 is to 3. So 2 is to 3. 2x plus 2x and 3x and another condition given as product of these two numbers is 216 mathematics low product and multiplication so we will multiply these two numbers 2x and 3x which is 216 2 3s are 6 x into x is x square which is 216 x square is equal to 216 by 6 36 so x will be obviously root over 36 which is plus or minus 6 so we will apply this x value in the two numbers. First number we have taken as 2x. Second number we have taken as 3x. So 2 into 6 is 12 and 3 into 6 is 18. So the two numbers are 12 and 18. Eighth question, write the formula to find the mode of group of data and explain each term in it. So formula to find mode is L plus F1 minus F0 by 2F1 minus F0 minus f2 into h we will discuss section 3 now in section 3 we have six questions and we have to write only four questions each question carries six marks total is 24 marks so we have choice out of six we can attempt any four students first question in long answer section 3 is draw a graph of the given polynomial p of x is equal to x square minus 5x plus 6 and finds is zeros so this is the graph and the zeros are 2 and 3. Fourteenth question, find the median of age of 100 residents of a colony from the following data. So based on this data, we have to find the median. We know the median formula which is nothing but L plus N by 2 minus CF by F into H. There is a formula to find the median class that is N by 2 which is 100. N is 100 total frequency by 2 which is 50. So this 50 comes after this class interval. So 30 to 40 is our median class. So once we recognize or identify the median class students, we have to find L. In this 30 to 40, L is lower limit and 40 is upper limit. So L value is 30. I am writing in the place of L as 30. N by 2 we got it as 50. CF. CF is nothing but 46 by F. F is the frequency which is 25 into height. H is width of the class interval which is 10. So this can be write, written as 30 plus 50 minus 46 is 4 by 25 into 10. 4 tens are 40 by 25. So 40 by 25 is nothing but 25 ones are 25 remainder is 15 we keep 0 which is 25 6 are 150 so 30 plus 1.6 is can be expressed as 31.6 so last problem of this question paper is construction construct an equilateral triangle of side 6 centimeters and construct a similar triangle to it whose side is 3 5 of the corresponding sides of first triangle as 3 by 5 value is always less than 1, our required triangle will be comes inside the given triangle which is this triangle. The name of the triangle is A, C dash, B dash or A, B dash, C dash is similar to A, B, C. Thank you for watching students.